we had decided uh, to terminate on Tuesday and serve notice on Thursday of last week, um, but provided the opportunity for Talis to dialogue with us about a settlement and well, perhaps that could have been confidential. Again, they walked away uh, from that opportunity by going public today. So we've been trying to be reasonable and trying to negotiate uh, and uh, act coolly and calmly on behalf of Edmontonians throughout this process. Um, but ultimately, we'll see them in court. The system has been running. The computers are on all the trains. The independent safety assessor has confirmed that the system is uh, safe based on international standards. Uh, in the industry, safety is not an emotional thing. It's not a, um, yeah, I feel safe, it's feel not safe. It's a deterministic thing. So there's international standards, Senelec standards, that, uh, that require boiling down the, the major hazards, you know, is the train going too fast for the track? Is the train allowed to cross a switch without the switch moving underneath the train? These are the types of things that, um, that lead us to believe that the system is, is safe and ready. Uh, unfortunately, the city has a different view. Uh, we intend to recover uh, our costs, all of our costs, because we did not get what we were promised from Talos 10 years ago when they agreed to deliver this system. And so we've paid them along the way. The money that's been held back was against performance. They have not performed, so we feel entitled to keep that. But we didn't get the product that we signed up for, so we're going to go after all of our costs to Talos, as well as additional costs, overtime, consultants, things that we've As I said, Talos provided a great de degree of uh, operational and maintenance support over the past three and a half years to help the city achieve the service levels that have been provided. And Talos uh, will be looking for compensation for that as well. Well, what I say to them is that the testing results uh, for the system that they submitted on December 4th show that their system does not work. It's unreliable, they failed to deliver, and that's that, and we've had enough. So, and that's, that's all our time for today.